So I randomly had get your motor running, get out on the highway going through my head as I was logging into the game, only to have Serena like get in my face. Hey! Quit that, lady. Anyway, what were we doing last time? Oh right, we have to rescue this moth priest guy! Because he's important or something, I don't remember exactly what the details were. Let's just go in and see what we can do about this situation. Xenophar is a filthy, filthy cheat. He is. Always. Biggest cheater ever. Biggest. Total jerk face. Alright. Serena, are you going to be nice and quiet for me? Can you hang out and be chill? Alright, cool. Hope this isn't a trap of some sort. Oh, we need to use our crossbow. I haven't gotten a lot of use out of this lately. Whoa. Whoa! Hey, yo! What the hell, yo, is going on, yo, in here, yo? Man, look at all this. Wow, this is pretty. What's going on over there, though? Wow. Okay. All right. We need a battle plan here. Let's, uh, let's see. What's the best way to get around? Okay, well, I guess there isn't really a staircase on that side, but there is sort of a fortress over here. Okay. That's what I'm going to do. All right. Let's do some quick sniper action and get these people that are just kind of hanging out. Oh, oh, man, he moved right at the right time. Damn it. Alerted his freaking friend, too. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's reset our stealth. Yeah, there we go. So this guy will stop moving around. E I kind of want to wait for him to stop moving because I don't have a crap ton of these bolts to waste. Where did he go? I don't even see him anymore. Oh, there he is. He's right there. He's in the darkness. You can barely make him out. A oh! They're all using dwarven arrows, apparently. I can recognize the make of those sheaths. Well, this is going to be a long shot if I can make this one. It'll be brilliant. Oh, 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 she's gonna move. Oh, I, I bet I can get her. Whoa! Ah, oh, too much. Too much. Too much descent. Steady aim. Oh, come on. Get her! Ah, oh, crap. She is, like, right out of my range. Alright, level up. Can we put some points in our archery stuff? That's alchemy, not archery. Archery, archery, arch archery. Uh, time slow, not really useful. I don't really want that. Ah. How much until we get our next bow skill upgrade? Yes! 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 I wanted that. Overdraw rank three. Good. Good, 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 good. Alrighty then. Okay, vampire. Vampire lady, you're about to get it. Because I can totally shoot you from here. Come on. Come on. Aw, oh, come on. I'm going to have to get closer. I can't make her from here. I'm not that good of a shot yet. I don't want to waste bolts. Let's just screw around and get around the outside. Pick off these dogs. They're easy fodder. They go down very, very easy. All these gargoyle statues are kind of making me nervous, though. Not gonna lie. Harvest this mushroom. Oh, there's no... No! Bad doggy. Bad, bad puppy. These collars. They're kind of pricey. I don't mind being able to sell those. Get a steel bolt back. Oh, the brightness. No. No to the brightness. Okay. 
Let's just go around the outside. Ooh, oh, oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. <sighs> Serena fell down. This isn't good. Maybe I can get back up there over this way. If I'm lucky. Just kind of jump on a rock. And jump up here. Oh, ooh, come on. Come on, kitty. Kitty, get out of the water. Oh, kitty. Kitty. Now you're all wet. Bad kitty. Get out of the water. There you go. Good kitty. Good kitty. Alright. Actually, this is better. This is a better perspective. I didn't have it this angle before. Oh, this is creepy. It's super creepy. I can't really see very well. Oh, that's a little better. Let's go around the outside of this wall here. Oh, there's that guy. That guy from earlier. Now oh, I can go daggers on this guy. Pork dagger. Uh, steel dagger. Yeah, got it. Nice! Excellent. Some arrows. A nice lock pick. Honey nut treat. Honey nut treat. Man, I could go for some Fruit Loops right now. Honey nuts and f honey nut Cheerios and Fruit Loops go very well together. Deactivate the magic barrier. Oh dear. Oh, the moth priest is in there. I bet. I can barely make out something in there. Okay. Okay, Serena, don't freak out. Where have you been? Okay, just hold up. Just hold up. Don't don't freak out and kill this guy. I want to sneak up on him. The light's getting all weird. Malchus. All right, let me be super 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 smart and throw on some. I still got this lotus extract. I don't want to use that yet. I want to use that on a bow. Uh. Do I have any poisons? Some really good damage poison. I could just use frostbite venom. There we go. Okay. Stop! Oh, in your face! <laughs> he resisted the venom because he's a vampire and I'm dumb. What is this? What kind of manner of acorn nut ball? I'll just take that, I guess. And some nice robes that I could sell later. Focus. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Search this chest. Oh, a mace. Cool mace. Two cool maces. Ray zombie thing. Cool. Alright. This is a random corpse. How do I deactivate this? Um... Let's see here. What about if I use this uh, focus? Can I equip it? No, I can't. If I jump into it, okay, that doesn't do anything either. Oh, there's a little pedestal up here. I see. I see it. I sees it. Let's see if we see anything else. No, we don't. Alright. Plug that in there. Oh God! I serve my master. Whoa! But my master is dead, and his enemies will pay. Oh no! Oh, he's enthralled in stuff. That's not good. He's an enthralled moth priest. I wonder if I can use poisons on him. Uh, sure. I want to kind of take him out from afar because this isn't very cool. Frostbite Venom. Let's see if I can actually poison him first. He might be a vampire. I missed. Like a boss. Oh, he's summoning little other vampire things. And they're summoning other vampire things. Oh. Actually, this might have been good for me. That was on complete accident, but if I could accidentally kill this guy, then what the heck. Dude, this Dexton guy is kind of crazy, though. I knew I heard something. Ah! 
Serena! Protect me! Oh no, now he sees me. Oh, now this is gonna get bad. Ah! Serena! No! Kill him! Yeah! Screw your face! Oh, was it? I could see through my eyes, but I could not control my actions. Oh. Thank you for breaking that foul vampire's hold over me. Well, I guess crossbow bolts are the best medicine then. Well, that was weird. Um, Serena, you can stop being... Just get rid of that. It's weird. Stop it. Stop it! There. Don't summon things. It's odd. Okay, Dexton, uh, tell me your story. I like your beard. You arrived just in time. I think those vampires were getting hungry. You okay? Uh, I'm quite all right, thanks to you. Dexian Evicus is my name. I'm a moth priest of the White Gold Tower. Oh! These vampires claimed they had some purpose in store for me, but they wouldn't say what. Probably hoping to ransom me, the fools. I know why they needed you, because we need you for the same purpose. You do? All right then, enough mysteries. We are called the Dawn Guard, and we need you to read an Elder Scroll. Actually... <laughs> yeah, that, that's fine, I'll just you be straight up with scroll. him. Remarkable. If my knowledge of history serves me, I recall that the Dawn Guard was an ancient order of vampire hunters. Yep. I will be happy to assist you with your Elder Scroll. Just tell me where I need to go. You can find us at Fort Dawnguard near Stendar's Beacon. Very well. I'll hurry on my way there before more of those vampires turn up. Wouldn't it be safer to just escort the dude? Okay. Well, I guess I'll trust him to get there by himself. I mean... I don't know, I kinda wanna like... put him in a Pokeball and stuff him in my pants or something. For protecting him. I don't have a f sexual fixation toward blind people, even though I'm sure they look very nice. I'm just. That would be safer than him going. Th never mind. Just. Never. Just don't even. Don't even bother. Don't even bother. My words will be forever misconstrued. Ross doesn't like blind people! Uh. Ah! I mean, I accidentally just said my name. <laughs> ah, I can't say words! Ah, Rick doesn't like blind people. He's the biggest racist in the world. No, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. God. That's what all the comments are going to be. All the comments are going to be about how much I hate blind people. Which is completely misconstrued. I just, I just wanted, wanted, I want him to be okay. I want him to just be okay, and he would be safer inside my pants. Despite what any of you may think, okay, it is a safer place than running through the wilderness. <sighs> it's true. All right, whatever. We're back. Fort Dawn Guard and stuff. Yeah, that's where we are right now. Okay. Hopefully he's back, too, and we didn't lose him somehow. Ezran, hello. I'm impressed you could find a moth priest so quickly. Yeah. Oh, I guess he is here, then. Well, that's good. Uh, does he have the scrolls? Everything ready? For the reading? Yeah. Just let the old man know when you're ready. There she is, walking in front of the camera again. Okay. Dexton, show us your moves. Show us your moves. I'm glad you made it here safely. Yeah, true, true, very true. Ah, my rescuer. It's good to see you again. I guess he isn't blind. What's well, good to know? Um, I'm like, there's a continuity error here somehow. Well, whatever, I guess it's not that important. Um, have my companions made you feel welcome? It's not exactly the hospitality I'm used to. But your man Isran has seen to my needs well enough. That's good. And might I add, 
This is a remarkable fortress. I have colleagues back home that would love to study this place in detail. Mm hmm. So, are you ready to read the Elder Scroll, Mr. Dexton? Oh, most certainly. Let's find out what secrets the scroll can tell. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, or I'll go I must over concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the night's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. Ooh. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. Uh. My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. I must rest now. The reading has made me weary. All right. Come on, old man. You should get some rest. Well, that was really nice of him to just kind of do that for us out of the middle of nowhere. Um. Hmm. Yeah, what's up, Serena? What's on your mind? That moth priest, Dexy. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. I think I know where we can start looking. Okay. Half the people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. That doesn't exactly make me want to open up. I got a warmer welcome from my father. That's saying something. Yeah, it is. He was a bastard. So what is it with between you two, anyway, with you and your dad? Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. Aww. So where's the Elder Scroll? We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. You said she didn't know where she went, though. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Hmm. Well, it sounds like she was being really cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Hmm. Where would she be? Some place that he would never look. Inside of his own castle! Wait. That almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Isn't that pretty risky, staying around the castle? Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. They aren't going to let us use the front door. True. But I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. Oh. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Hmm. Alright. Let's go to the castle's secret entrance, then. It's around the side of the castle. Let's move. Nice. Explore Castle Volkier's Courtyard. So I guess we're going back to the castle already, even though we've been banished. <laughs> Funny. Alright. So let's get on the road. I think we need to go... Actually, let me check really quick. How's my inventory looking? Uh, items... Eh, I've still got a, more than 100 knots of space, so... I think I'm okay on that front. Let's see. Castle Volkir. Volkar. 
I think, uh, let me make sure. I need to watch that quest really quick. I need to watch this one too, and this one too, and dear lord, I have so many things to do. So we have three quests as part of this storyline now. So I guess the first one we need to do is actually to do the one Serena was just talking about with going to Volcare's courtyard. So let's go ahead and get on that first. Fast travel to the island so we don't have to spend another like thousand gold on it. That was annoying. Shadowmere, how'd you get out of here? We're on a freaking waterlocked island, bro. Crazy little horse. Okay. Spiky grass. So, we need to just walk around to the north side of this island, I guess? Hmm. Yeah. She did say it was going to be on the north side. Wow, it is creepy out here. Creepy. Yeah, just around this creepy, bend. creepy. Why do I get the weird feeling she's about to stab me in the back? It doesn't look so big from down here. I mean, it is big, but well, even bigger. Yeah. Okay, let's go into sneak mode. This really looks like a really old port. Something you would expect surprise attacks from. Oh, look at that. How did I even know? What we got here? We got, I think, two people right up front. Who's there? I knew it. I think Serena's going all out. Go, Serena, go! Get him! That skeleton's not dying very easily. Are there any more things around here? I'm getting some good sneak attacks in, that's good. Her little minion isn't doing anything. Still out of combat. Well, kill it. I'm having trouble <laughs> figuring out which one's which here. Well, I guess that's the skeleton. And uh, her resurrected skeleton is being completely useless, but he's got cool armor on. Die, please. Are you serious? What kind of bullshit is this? Hey! Face! Steel bolts. I will take that back. Thank you. Oh, we got more dudes over there. I thought I heard another skeleton up on that ledge. I can't really see them very well. Are they dead? Alright, yeah. And I just wasted a bolt for no reason. Hooray! I can take that back and get another one. Alright, cool. Well, I guess this is the back entrance, and we've made enough of a noise trying to get in. Which is all her fault, because she ran ahead like a crazy person, of course. Like I would expect Serena to do anything else at this point. Crazy person. Let's see, did I randomly pick up a bow I don't need? Supple Ancient Nord Bow. Wow, what is that thing's stats compared to our crossbow? Uh, shh. Poop. Get out of here. Out of here. At least now I know those aren't, aren't normal skeletons, though, because they were kind of fierce. 